The Dallas Cowboys are at odds of 18 to 1 to win the Super Bowl. Their 2016 season win total is set at nine games. The team is at odds of plus 932 to win the NFC, while they're at plus 145 to win the NFC East Division. Last season saw the Dallas Cowboys go a disappointing 4 and 12 straight up, while going 4 11 and 1 against the spread. The team went 6 and 10 on the over under. The Dallas Cowboys are expected to be vastly improved this season with the healthy Tony Romo at quarterback, a healthy Des Bryant at wide receiver, and with rookie running back Ezekiel Elliott getting a ton of work. The Cowboys won just four games a season ago, but odds makers really like Dallas this season as they set the win total for the team at nine. The concern for the Dallas Cowboys is keeping their key players healthy as they still don't have a proven backup quarterback and they don't have anyone who can take the place of Bryant at receiver. Another concern for Dallas is improving a defense that was just middle of the road last season. It helps that the NFC East is one of the weakest divisions in the NFL. The Dallas Cowboys were simply awful last season on offense without Tony Romo at quarterback. They should be much better this season with a healthy Romo and a healthy Des Bryant. It also helps that the Cowboys have a rookie running back in Ezekiel Elliott, who some people are already predicting could lead the NFL in rushing this season. The Cowboys have an excellent offensive line, and if they keep Romo healthy, they will have a decent passing attack. Dallas also has one of the top kickers in the league in Dan Bailey, for instances when the offense stalls. This sounds like a broken record, but the Dallas defense should be improved if they can stay healthy. Sean Lee is an outstanding linebacker when he's on the field, but he always seems to be hurt. If he can stay healthy, then the Cowboys have some quality in the middle with Lee and Rolando McClain. The front four is nothing special with Lawrence, Thornton, Crawford, and Irving, while the secondary is also suspect with Carr and Claiborne at the corners. Dallas did take Jalon Smith in the NFL draft, who they hope can contribute at linebacker but they didn't do too much to improve the secondary. There is no question that Dallas should be better than last season when they won just four games, but the optimism may be too high for this team, especially since Jason Garrett is still the head coach. Romo is an injury waiting to happen, and if he goes down, the team will be in trouble again. The offense will be improved with Ezekiel Elliott running the ball, but the defense still isn't very good, and the schedule this season is not easy. It is all about Romo staying healthy, because if he misses any time, then finishing with a winning record will be too much to ask for the Dallas Cowboys in 2016. Join us at BetDSI.com for the best Dallas Cowboys betting options, including futures, props, and live in-progress betting during the game.